Uh, welcome back to another Zest session. Um, so this theme is all about uh, boxing and martial arts, okay? So it's a really good way to get all your stress out. Um, I'll be back with lovely Louise. Hi. <laughs> you love boxing, don't you? I do like yeah. boxing. We're going to have some good fun punching and kicking today. Just the air, not each other. Um, so Louise is standing as always. Her feet are hip width apart or wider and has a chair to hang on to if she's not a bit more balanced. Uh, I'm going to sit for this one and my feet are flat on the floor and I'm going to sit up nice and tall so imagining I have a bit of string connecting my head up to the ceiling okay um, just move as far as feels comfortable for you and if anything hurts or doesn't feel right um, just join back in when you're ready all right um, so the first thing I'm going to do is get warmed up so we're going to practice making a fist okay so just bringing your hands up I want you to close them and then open good and making sure that thumb goes on the outside of your fingers. Okay, lovely. Keep breathing and breathing. I'm breathing. Good, excellent. And just, you don't have to keep in time with us, just move as however fast or slow feels comfortable for you. And if you can't open your hands all the way, it doesn't matter. Just open them as however feels comfortable. But we're gonna close the fist and then open them. So we're getting those fingers and thumbs moving. Lovely, and obviously in boxing, making your fist is quite important. We need to make sure we get that right. It's really important not to put your thumb on the inside. The thumb goes outside. Two more. Good. And then I want you to intertwine your fingers, okay? And just start moving the wrists around. Lovely. So just before we grab our boxing gloves, we're going to get the wrists nicely warmed up. Fantastic. How are we feeling? Fine. You just want to get punching, <laughs> don't you? <laughs> Good, so just moving those wrists around, relax those shoulders down, my shoulders are all tense there. Good, moving it all around. Lovely. Good, shake out those arms. Good, rest down, take a nice deep breath in. As we breathe out, we're just gonna practice our footwork, so that's really important in boxing, okay? So you just wanna tap your toe forward and bring it back. So almost like you're pretending to move forward, but then you actually don't, so we're going to fake out our opponent. Good. So just tapping it as far forward as feels comfortable for you. Doesn't matter how big the step is. But as always, sitting or standing nice and tall, keep looking forward. Keep those tummy muscles working hard. Good. And nice deep breaths. Lovely. Good. Fantastic. Couple more. And let's rest there. Good. Shake out those legs. We're going to take a deep breath in. Breathe out. Right, we're going to start grabbing our gloves. So reach across and grab your gloves. It's scattered all over the place. So just keep reaching and grabbing for your gloves. We're going to get ourselves ready for the big fight. We're going to do some punching. We're going to do some knee strikes and kicking. We're going to block. It's going to be fun. It's going to be epic. <laughs> <laughs> Louise is really good at punching. <laughs> So just watch out, everybody, when she Depends comes. That's what it is. <laughs> we won't <laughs> ask. <laughs> we best not go there, should we? <laughs> it does help when you can picture someone, doesn't it? <laughs> Good. A few more of those. Good. Got our gloves? Yep. Good. Excellent. Shake out the arms. Good. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to learn how to duck a punch. Okay? So you're going to sidestep and duck under. That's it. Good. So you've got a little bit of squatting going on. Good. So that punch comes at you and you get underneath it. Lovely. You don't have to go too low. So what happens is when the punch comes, it just skims the top of your head. So don't worry about getting down too far. Good. Fantastic. Good. So just get under and get back up. A couple more. Good. Rest there. Well done. Give it a little bit of shake. Right, you ready for some punching? Yes. I can feel like getting impatient. Here we go. Right, so fists <laughs> up. Protect your jaw. We're going to punch out to the front. Oh, she's loving it, look. Loving it. So your fist, your palm of your fist goes towards the floor. And I want you to imagine the person you're punching is of the same height as you. So aim for their nose, basically. And just punch it forward and then squeeze it back. Make sure you keep breathing. This is when people stop breathing. Are we breathing? I'm breathing. She is breathing. Good. She's not going blue yet. Fantastic. Good. 
and punching those arms forward. Lovely jubbly. Good. Oh, works the shoulders, doesn't it? There it goes. Good. And then we return our hands back to our jaw, always protecting your jaw, keeping your guard up. Lovely. A couple more. Oh, lovely. Right, rest there. Shake out the arms. Deep breath in. We're going to do some knee strikes. Are you ready? Yep. Okay, so we're going to strike up, strike it up. Good. Lovely. So this comes in with the Muay Thai. So Muay Thai is called the art of the eight limbs. I don't know why, because I've only got four. But there it is, and they do a lot of knee striking. Fantastic. And just strike those legs up as high as feels comfortable. Oh, gets you warmer, doesn't it? How are you feeling? Fine. Good. A bit warm. A bit warm. Good. A few more. Fantastic. Let's rest there. Just shake out those legs. Deep breath in. You ready for the next punch? I am. So we're going to do a hook. So you're going to bend the elbow. You're going to hook around and then hook. So imagining, again, the person in front of you is the same height. You're aiming for the side of their face and you're going to go through it. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. So get 90 degree angle in that elbow and we keep that as we punch around. So you're coming straight across. Fantastic. Good. And then after you've done the punch, you drop back down because your elbow and your arm is protecting your ribs. Lovely jubbly. Good. Feeling okay? Fine. Good. Right, you should remember these punches because when we do the next one, I'm going to ask you what your favourite punch is. <laughs> okay. It's very important to know. Two more. Lovely. Let's rest there. Oh, shake out the arms. Good. Deep breath in. Breathe out. So we're going to do a kickboxing move. We're going to do some front kicks. Okay. Right. So just kick that leg up. So your knee comes up. That's it. And then you flick out that lower limb. Lovely. And just kick as high or as low as feels comfortable for you. Try and stay up tall. Look straight ahead. If you're standing, use that chair if you need to, to hang on. And just make sure there's nothing in front of you that you're going to kick. Okay. Good. Lovely kick. <laughs> You don't have to worry about punter pointing your toes. You don't want to kick with pointed toes. Okay, so you can actually pull your toes back. Lovely. Two more. Good, rest there. Well done. Shake it out. Lovely wide feet. Good. Breathe in. As you breathe out, you ready for that last punch? Yep. Okay, uppercut. Go. Punch it up. Lovely. So this is the under the chin punch. So the arm comes straight up to the ceiling. Good. And you're going to punch under the chin and then carry on a little bit just to uh, really make it worthwhile. So favourite punch, Louise, what is it? This one by far. Oh, she loves an uppercut. <laughs> and she's got a lovely little bounce there and her legs going on. So the knees are nice and soft, not tensing because all that power can come from the bottom of the legs. Good. Excellent. You have got a lovely uppercut. <laughs> Very strong. Good. Keep breathing. Nice deep breaths. Good. A few more. You nearly got knocked out. Nearly. Fantastic. Rest there. Good work. Shake out those arms. Take a nice deep breath in. Breathe it out. Right, he's trying to get away from us now. Right. So we're going to march after him. Come on, off we go. We've got to get after our opponent. He's trying to get away. So we're going to chase him around the ring. Or her. Come on, her. Could be fighting anybody. Good. Here we go. Good. We can actually have a little breather now while we're trying to catch him. So nice deep breaths. Fantastic. We've got him. Rest there. Good. Deep breath in. Breathe out. He's starting to throw punches at us. Right. So we're going to block. Okay. So your forearm is going to come up, down, and then other side. So you're sweeping that arm over your head. This is a karate move or taekwondo, either or. Okay. So we block and block. Lovely. Good work. What did you remind you of? Prince Charming. <laughs> Everybody knows him. <laughs> back in the day. Back in the day. I loved Adam <laughs> back in the day. I, mean, I don't know if he stole this from martial arts, but it was a very good move. <laughs> good. A few more. Lovely. Last punch. Good. Rest there. Shake out those arms. Oh, lovely. Deep breath in. Breathe it out. 
Good, I just want you to do some shrugs now. So just roll those shoulders up and all the way down. We're just going to cool down. So the fight is over. Did we win? Oh, obviously. Obviously. Did we knock out? We said, oh, yes. Oh, so knock out. Fantastic, <laughs> obviously. It was an uppercut, wasn't it? It was. <laughs> Good, two more. Good, one more. I can't count, can I? Good. Hands at the top of your thigh. I want you to do is just rub down, just roll it down, and then slowly roll back up. And just go as low as feels comfortable for you. Just breathe in as you roll down and breathe in as you roll up. Two more. Nice deep breath in. Lovely. Last one. It's nice and slow. Breathe in and breathe out. Fantastic. Okay, we're gonna have a little stretch again, all right? So if you're standing, just bring one out, well, one leg out in front. If you're sitting, stretch that leg. Lovely, a little lean forward. So bring that front leg nice and straight, that's it. And you'll feel a stretch up the back of the legs. It's really important to stretch after we've been boxing and fighting and everything. You need to be very flexible for martial arts. Good, deep breaths. And let's change leg. Good. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Good, bring that leg back in. And then we're going to go chest stretch. So bring those arms nice and wide. Relax the shoulders down. Just feel that lovely stretch across the chest. And a big hug. Lovely rest there. Take a deep breath in. As you breathe out, round of applause, celebrate your win. Well done, everybody. Hope you enjoyed that and we'll see you soon.